Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to Beer Geek Nation. Thank you so much for joining me once again. This, my friends, is from Terrapin Brewing Company. This is their Sunray Wheat Beer, which is a 4.5% alcohol by volume, Hefeweizen, brewed with honey which sounds really, really nice to me. Um, 4.5 Hefeweizen, I love that style of beer. Sounds really, really drinkable. Um, like I said, I've never had this one before. It's available now, widely available if you can get Terrapin stuff. So with that said, let me get into a glass so you know what it smells, tastes, and give you guys the verdict on the Sunray Wheat from Terrapin Beer Company. All right, guys, so the appearance on the Terrapin Sunray Wheat Beer, it's what I would expect. Um, Gorgeous, gorgeous, really beautiful, beautiful golden haze to it. Um, nice two, two to three fingers worth of tight white bubble head on there. Can't see anything through it. Um, very traditional looking wheat beer. Um, it is a little bit darker than I'm used to as far as a wheat beer, but it's just a, you know, a perfect example of what wheat, of what a Hefeweizen yeast can do to a beer. Yeah, it's got that... Um, Definitely got an American Hefeweizen smell to it. It doesn't have that banana or clove character that you would expect from like a Bavarian um, Hefeweizen, like a Weinstefan or something like that. It's got that kind of Hefeweizen um, funkiness to it. I almost think it smells like bologna, believe it or not. It just has that kind of bologna smell to it. There's definitely some spiciness in there. There's a sweetness, there's an effervescent kind of quality to it, almost like a Sprite character to it. Nice bright kind of citrusy hop coming through in this one. Honey sweetness definitely present. It's an interesting smelling beer. It smells very traditional to an American style Hefeweizen. Right at the front of the tongue, I'm getting um, a slight hop bitterness. Middle of the tongue, I'm actually getting more clove and banana than I was getting in the, in the aroma. Um, it is more of kind of a Bavarian type of Hefeweizen taste to it. There's a nice spiciness in there, kind of a nice kind of clove um, bite to it. Um, I am getting a little bit of sweetness in there, definitely probably from the honey. Um, nice, nice dry finish, a little bit of a sweet aftertaste. It's actually a really nice, refreshing taste of hef tasting Hefeweizen. Is it the best one I've ever had? No, but it's definitely there. It definitely kind of verges on the border of an American and Bavarian. Um, getting some of the hop character in the front. That sweetness, definitely you don't get that in a lot of uh, Bavarian Hefeweizen. Nice kind of clove, banana, spice, definitely coming through, but not quite as present as I like it in a traditional Hefeweizen, but again, it's an American one, so I would expect that. It's a nice drinking beer, obviously at 4.5%, you don't taste any of the alcohol. Nice, nice mouth feeling here, really kind of coats the mouth with a breadiness. Big kind of wheat character in this one. Um, nice carbonation to help clean the palate. It's a nice tasting beer, it really is. All right, the final verdict on Terrapin Beer Company's Sunray Wheat Beer, 4.5% available now. Get it if you enjoy half of license for the summers. I'm gonna give this one a B minus. Um, as far as summer beers go, it's really nice and drinkable. Actually, it has a lot more flavor than most summer beers do, so that's a plus in the book. Nice honey character to it. There's nice sweetness in there. Um, nice clove, nice banana. It just, it, it's kind of unremarkable. Um, it doesn't do anything real great, but it doesn't do anything real bad, you know? So it's just kind of there. Um, I'd much rather have this than say, you know, a, a typical summer lager from whoever. Um, this has got a lot of flavor to it. Um, well, I use a lot of flavor in reference to a 4.5% alcohol beer, um, but definitely a lot of flavor there. A nice, nice character. There's just, there's nothing wrong with it. There's just nothing really doing it for me um, there. So with that said, guys, remember life is too short. Drink amazing beers, guys. Cheers.